Hello, Keiko here, and welcome to the chaos. Let's go. What is the plan for today? Well, there is a new event of some description. It's a little event, because looking at it, there's only, only one section that's unlocked. But I'm thinking we'll go and start this anyway, and have a go and do the first one. And then I'll be able to tell if it's like an on-stream event or an off-stream event. And because there's only one, it shouldn't take too long. And there's always some dialogue at the start. We love some dialogue. So we'll go through that. And then the plan is to go back to Petrichor and finish exploring this area. Because I think we explored like 80% of it. There's a little bit we didn't do. And I want to make sure we got everything. And then we're going to be going again into Rumeria because we're going to follow the quest just so we can run around and explore that area and get all the waypoints. I think it's probably this. <laughs> See, they've, they've changed the map. They've got all, all the regular areas and then they've put like a line and there's three funky ones. So I'm going to assume this is Rumeria that we haven't unlocked yet, but we could unlock that. We could go there. Um, and they obviously put the teapot at the bottom. Um, and then once that is done, assuming that doesn't take the whole stream. Oh, and somewhere in the middle, there'll be boss time, obviously. But somewhere in the middle, we're going to go back over here because there's some people here we haven't talked to. So in the last stream, we went over here and unlocked the waypoint and saw there's a new sort of harbor, but we haven't talked to anybody. And I was thinking we could talk to some people and then also see if there's anything like over here and over here. Because we sort of followed this path and there was some stuff there, but there wasn't anything. We didn't check over here. And I feel like we should do that. Maybe a little bit. Maybe see if there's anything in this pond. Actually, I think I ran past this pond. I think I know if there's anything in this pond. But yeah, that's my plan. Um, and then if there's any time left, which I highly doubt at this point, uh, we'll go back to what we were supposed to be doing, which was, I think, exploring this place. Because a couple streams ago, it was a while ago now, we did manage to like figure out, we, I think, covered the whole of this area. And so now, there's just this area had some more spaces we didn't explore very well that we could look at. And yeah. <laughs> so that's the very long plan. I don't think we're going to do all of it, but we're going to try to do as much as possible. So yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay, okay. So, I guess it's uh, time to see what this vibro crystal thing is. Let's go. Let's see. Where is it? Ooh! Near the chasm. Makes sense, makes sense. Now let's see. Where's the monologue? There's the monologue. We've got the pinned message. The pinned message is always a good message. <laughs> uh, oh, you're just being dodgy. Well, that's... That's upsetting. That's very upsetting. But I hope it fixed itself. Okay, okay. Let's see. So, where are we going? This way. Okay, how am I going to get that? Ooh. Okay. Okay. I feel like we've done this event before. Oh, what has happened? Hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to move? Hmm. That's not good. <laughs> okay. It seems like keyboard is a little bit unresponsive. So I'm hoping this is a temporary glitch. But if not, I may have to swap the batteries or something so I may have to do that hopefully it will not die on me in the middle of an urgent situation because that would be very awkward and also probably what's gonna happen because because that seems like the best time for things to break it's always what you don't want them to break <sighs> okay uh, let's see uh, stop it Patrice our current experiments run completely contrary to the Institute's directives you mean the one on the approval document that says this project should produce technology that provides greater economic benefits? You just want to know if it can be sold for more. Don't worry about that. We need to continue testing and gathering data, yeah? So you'll need to give up me some more Mora to buy Vibro Crystals. We don't have that much funding left. What are you going to get the Mora to hide testers once you've blown it all? Or are you going to do it yourself? Uh, well, you must remember, dear Anatole, that research supervisors of outdoor experiments must, if necessary, dictate, assist the researcher in performing testing. I'll leave the next experiment to you then. Uh, alas, uh, also, I recall you have a considerable quantity of travel funds, yes? You could always eat fewer meals and... Oh, and now you're putting it upon your colleagues to save more on your behalf? Ah, Patrice, how hard your heart is. 
Now Mora is for bamboo shoot soup, not a wicked villain such as yourself. Now yeah, you can always work less, but you should never eat less. Precisely so. Ah, I knew it to teach such piercing insults, you must be the famous. That's right, Paimon was the renowned Paimon. Then this must be the renowned Keiko. Uh, that's me, the famous me? Imagine I'm already a bit more than just renowned. That's me, the famous me. Anyway, it's just as Paimon says, how could I ever skimp on food? What should I do then? If I don't have the funding to conduct my experiments, forget the prospects of greater economic benefits. The only prospects away to me will be tragedy. <sighs> ah, and by the way, what were you two talking about with all those prospects? Are you prospecting? Economic benefits? Are you two researching how to prospect for more? Uh, whoa, is there any chance you'll find a way to make more just spurt out of the ground like a fountain? Oh, I'm in. I'd like a cut. Uh, no, no, not the kind of prospect at all. That said, I do believe my research products prospects will turn out to be just as valuable. We need to settle the funding issue first. Also, we need to design an invention that will sell well. <sighs> great inventions are often mere byproducts of great research. Marvelous inventive ideas leap forth like stingrays from your mind as you conduct said research. They'd better. Wait, hold on a sec. Pine was getting curious now. Just what sort of research are you doing? We're working on ores known as vibro crystals. We discovered them in Nia previously while studying the different properties of ore in the region. It can be divided into two types transmitter and receiver crystals. When the transmitter crystal is stimulated in a certain way, it will release a specific energy that resonates with the receiver crystal half, generating unique effects. Which is an interesting phenomenon, albeit one that, let's just say, the Fontanian Research Institute isn't nearly as interested in ores as it used to be. Uh, Mr. Raimondo's also been clear it lacks economic benefits, ergo, it wouldn't bring the money in. Such shallowness! Uh, in any case, Patrice was stimmied while applying for funding. He didn't manage to secure any more, only an honorary title. I thought I could at least use the title of guaranteed interim loan from the Northland Bank. At the moment the clerks heard I was an institute engineer, their smiles melted like snow in spring. And no wonder, considering how hard our lot have abused it, that trick. So it is as you see, we're out of funding and we can't even hire adventurers to help perform our experiments, nor do we even have the foggiest idea about possible inventions. Uh, not that this comes any surprise, I must admit that it's tough living in a foreign land with little funding while performing complex experiments, maintaining the experimental site and also trying to design an invention. Uh, well, how about we help out Keiko? Oh, Paimon's going to become a great inventor, eh? Paimon doesn't know the first thing about inventing, but we could do the performing experiments part, right? But could, could you really? Uh, well, here's an experienced adventurer should you need one. In that case, we'll leave the experiment in your hands, Keiko. Paimon, all the best, the success of the project is riding on you. I hope so I'll dig out whatever you've got left for travel expenses. Alright, you're right, but I'm only parting with a bit we owe Keiko and Paimon for helping with our experiments. No more. As for the rest, we'll see how your project design work comes along, Patrice. Uh, sure, sure. At least the experiments can continue. In that case, we'll leave the experiment in your hands, Keiko. Paimon, all the best. The success of the project is riding on you. Don't you worry, just leave it to us. Okay. Uh, anything else? No way to make money. I've got it. If you just attach the receiver crystal to the rope pull mechanism that controls the lightning, all you have to do is activate the transmitter crystal from afar and ta-da, lights off. The rope pull mechanism that goes with the receiver crystal would cost an absolute fortune. In the early stages of applying new technologies, costs are always high, but once there's demand for it and production takes off, they'll gradually calm down. But wouldn't it be more, make more sense to just use a longer rope? It'd be cheaper and have exactly the same effect as your mechanism. Well, you can also attach the receiver crystal to things that you're prone to losing. The amateur is placed at an item, simply activate the transmitter crystal, and voila, I found again. That one. That one is a good idea. <laughs> Great idea, but what if I lose the transmitter crystal? In that case, just attach another receiver crystal to your transmitter crystal, that way it'll earn double the money too. You're a genius, Anatole. I'm not sure if I'm a genius, but it's clear you're nowhere close to deserving that epithet. Ugh, Patrice, think of something practical for once, would you? Ah. Uh... No, I like that second idea. It seems like a good idea. With that, you'd never lose anything again. And then you could they could charge so much. Why are you charging you so much for all the different crystals? Uh, okay, uh, two parties. Okay, I think we've done this before, and I- Oh, it's this thing. I forgot how this thing works. And I didn't read it again, so I have clearly double forgotten how it works. Oh, and the keyboard's not responding. Okay, this is this is not a good sign. Hmm. Hmm. Give me give me one moment. I'm gonna see if I can fix the keyboard. <laughs> I will. Well, I'll just I'll just mute myself. But okay, G give me a minute. Okay, I've put new batteries in the keyboard, so hopefully that works. And if not. Oh well, we'll have to think of another solution imminently. But, you know, so far in the two seconds since I switched the batteries, it seems to be working. So, I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> okay, uh, ooh, an ammo attacks. Okay, okay. Okay. 
Okay. Uh. Hmm. Ooh. <gasps> they gave us some trial characters. Okay. Well, I guess we should. Hmm. Let's let's put a Kazaha in there. And then I don't know. Uh. This is so stressful. Okay, we'll just do our normal party, but we'll put... Hmm... We'll, we'll put that! That's a normal party. That will do. And then we can pick some resonances. Uh... Well... Ooh... We'll do that. will do. <laughs> uh, and then for the second round we'll, we'll have Xiao. Um, and then we need some swirls, right? So we'll put Xiangling in there, I guess. Uh, and maybe... Hmm. We probably need some kind of healer, actually. Well, how does Xiao... I forgot how Xiao works. I think he takes a lot of damage. Hmm. So I don't end very well. But that is okay. Uh put Farina in there. She can heal him. Uh and then I don't know. Shinobu? <laughs> oh I didn't change the crystals. Uh, it's fine. <laughs> this'll probably hopefully this will be easy. If not, oh well. We'll we'll find out later. Okay, okay. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Do I remember what's happening? No, but that's okay. Just gonna click all the buttons and hope that it works, because it just should work. Ooh. And then now we've set something on Oh. Okay, I was gonna say now we've set them on fire, we should get a... Get this ready. But uh, apparently it just kind of fought itself so that's that's good if it wants to be simple i will i will take that <laughs> i don't actually know how this thing works yet i like i read the instructions and then i didn't really read the instructions because i thought this is just a fighting thing what i have to do is uh fight things so it should be simple but that also means i really did not read the instructions like at all so hopefully that's okay <laughs> I don't regret this immediately. I mean, so far it seems to be working, but I'm not really sure if this is one of those ones where you have to defeat a certain number of enemies, or if this is one of those ones where you have to defeat as many as possible within a certain time frame. Because it could be either. It, it could be either. <laughs> no way to know. Not really. Oh, But I do know that they do go down very quickly, which is good for me. Very good for me. Uh, let's see if we can do this. Uh, okay, okay. Oh, more Hydro Mimics. Very good, because we have lots of Dendro. And lots of Dendro is very good for Hydro Mimics. Because Bloom Court. <laughs> it stops the uh, the party inefficiency is that there is no Hydro in this team. But with the, the Hydro Mimics, it doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Mushrooms? I think I'm not usually this strong. Are these guys just really weak? Or is that all of these buffs that I just forgot about? But I feel like this is not usually- like, usually it takes longer for this to work. Like, I feel like I'm getting rid of these guys very quickly. Like, disproportionately quickly. It's not usually- I'm not usually this good. <laughs> and therefore I am a little bit suspicious. Why am I- why am I doing so well? This is- this is unusual. This is unprecedented. Very suspicious, this is. Very suspicious. Oh, it does seem like I am approaching the end, though, because the time is running out. Okay. I have no idea if I got a good score or a bad score, but that's fine. Okay. Do you want to 
wanna do some things. Okay, go on Xiao. Do I remember how Xiao works? No. <laughs> but that's fine. That's fine. I just know you're supposed to plunging attack. That that's all I remember. And I think one of the uh, crystals was supposed to give you a boost to plunging attack, so that's probably beneficial. Oh, okay. Now his health is real low. But that's okay. We'll just do that and then Xiao will get better. And it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Go on, Xiao. I believe in you. Go, go on, Xiao. You, you got this. You got this. Oh. Okay. Oh, I forgot Shinobu's a healer as well. That was kind of an embarrassing thing to forget, but that's okay. <laughs> this is going to make this whole thing a little bit easier. Uh, okay, well, let's do that. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. And it's fine. Xiao can just... Xiao can just do this. Oh. Come back here. You're too far away. Come, come back here so I can reach you. There we go. There we go. There we go. I am missing completely, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, okay, let's do that. And let's do this. And it's ready, it's ready. Oh, I missed completely. Oh, there it is. I see you. I see you. Oh, oh that was quick. They are... Xiao is very strong. This Xiao that they gave me as a trial character, very strong. Very, very strong. Very convenient. Very convenient indeed. Uh, let me just click all the buttons. That's not the button I meant to click. I meant to click this button. And we did this again. Is that... Okay. Oh, there's more of them. How many of them are there? I should really get better at memorizing which order they come in because it's very... It's very standard. Is that enough? Oh, I think it was. Hold on, Xiao. <laughs> uh, okay. I already got bronze. Well, that's a bit rubbish. Is this because, oh, I probably could have upped the multiplier. I remember this. This was the one where I tried up the multiplier and then I failed miserably. Oh well, at least we did that. Okay, I'm gonna do the rest of these off stream because uh, combat events are not my forte, especially when they actually are combat events. <laughs> Unlike some of the other ones where it's not really, it's a combat event, but most of it's to do with the mechanics. This one, okay, probably has to do with the mechanics, but I don't understand the mechanics, so, so it didn't help very much. But anyway, now we've uh, given up on that. <laughs> Next, the next part of my my plan was we were gonna go back in here. We were gonna run around and make sure I did everything. Like put all the magical books away. You know, we need to, we need to check everything. Every room has been entered. We gotta get unlost. I mean, if, if you think about it, this is just another ruin, right? So really, this is just a continuation of my desert ruin hunting, uh, except it's, you know, in underwater. <laughs> same, same concept. Please, you came back to error codes. Well, that's that's not good. I hope it unerror coded. That would be that would be ideal. Uh, combat events are too hard. They are. I can never get like gold. Well, sometimes I can, but usually I can't. And then I just make a fool of myself when I try. Every single time. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see, is there anything in here? I remember going in here last time. But what did I see in here? I don't remember. I'm gonna have to have a look. Okay. <gasps> a rock. Let me grab a rock. Love a good rock. <laughs> I really didn't need another rock, but that's okay. Oh! Ah. Uh, is he gonna try and fight me? So he's gonna try and fight me, isn't he? I think if you're on the back. No. Oh, oh no, oh no. <sighs> okay, we've been here. And now we have to fight him again. That's okay. Go on, Klee, I believe in you. You can fight the guy. You you can fight the guy. Oh, Klee, that's not good. 
in case I'm back a bit clee. And then, uh, and then we need you to keep fighting the guy because you're the only one who can break the stone. <laughs> but it's okay. We did it. We did it. Let me grab these. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Did we read this? I feel like I did. Oh yes, I definitely read this. I I remember reading that. Okay. Okay. Let's let's leave. <laughs> Okay, well we did that, that's good. Oh, we did, that's good. <laughs> I'm glad everything started functioning normally. Always a good sign, always a good sign. Uh, okay, so there's, there's three ways we can go. We can go straight. Yeah, to the right and to the left. So we'll go this way first, which is what I did last time, I remember this. Ooh, the combat mini game was difficult. Yeah, that that is true. That is very. How are you supposed to fight a level seventy any enemy with a level twenty character? That's just not gonna work. That just it does it just doesn't work. It just doesn't work. You need your characters to be of a similar level if you want to stand a chance. Unfortunately. Okay, we went into here. There's nothing here. Uh, let's go over here. We talked to this cat, the cat told us some things, and now we're going up here. Okay, and then we can go in a couple of different ways, so we can go this way. Which again, I think we've already been here, but we'll do it again anyway, just, just in case. Just in case I miss something. Also, we can, we can pick up more stuff. Oh, some more notes. Uh, we also did this. Wait, did we read this? Hmm. Oh no, we read that. We read that. Uh, and then, and then there's this place, which I also remember we went to because there's that giant fish, and the cat told us to ignore the fish, and we we did this puzzle. And okay, okay. I'm just gonna pick up all the stuff. Also, I like that they put one of these little library stand things. They're quite fun. Uh, okay, let's go over here. Ooh. And then wait, did I not pick up the thing? Hmm? That's strange. Uh, anyway, so then we gotta go back this way. Okay, and then there's a cross or back. Okay, okay. Okay, well what goes what's back up here? I know we went up there before as well. Where does it go now? We gotta be thorough, otherwise I will miss something and then I will be sad. <laughs> and also I'll have missed something and I won't be able to, well I will be able to get it back later, but I usually don't come back and then I'll just have left it forever and that'll be very sad. <laughs> we gotta check. Okay, I remember going through this door as well. We'll go back through the door, just in case. And there's a lizard. Oh, I forgot about this guy. I forgot about this guy. This is quite bad. Because <laughs> I keep forgetting where where they are, which means I'm just going to keep coming back and getting ambushed by all of these guys. Oh no, oh no. It's fine, it's fine. No, 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 no. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Clee, are you ready? Okay, Clee's ready. Oh, Clee, run away, run away, Clee. Run away. Run away, run away, run away. Okay. Okay. Okay, it's fine. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Problem solved. Uh, have we done this? Yep, we've done this as well. Anything this way? Not really. <gasps> There's a spin crystal, though. I saw that. I saw it. How did we get it? 
we supposed to get it a different pathway? You're probably not just supposed to jump for it. But but I have now. Or maybe you are. I don't see another way to get up here. Not an obvious one. Hmm. Maybe you were just supposed to jump for it. Okay. Okay, well. I think that this is where I was. Yep, okay, that's where I was. So now we can go down here to see what's over here. Uh, okay, okay. Anything, anything here? Not really. Anything in here? Oh. Another, another notebook. I think that's the one. Is this the one where it told me about all the music? Yep, this is the one we already read. I remember that one. That's the one telling me about like the music of humans, the music of the world. So you don't have to read that one. We can, we can ignore that one. Uh, okay. And then we can go back over here. And then. And then there's some zips on this side. Anything on the side? Hmm. Oh, okay. Anything? Anything up here? Nope. What about? Down here. Anything down here? Oh, is this how we got? Oh, there's another one of these. Oh, okay, you see me. This is not good. This is this is oh that one hit took out like half of Nahida's health. That's not good. That's not good. Oh no, oh no, oh no, it's fine, it's fine. Yuegoi will save me. Oh, Yuegoi's gone, that's less good. Okay, okay, it's all good, it's all good. Is it, is it done? It's done, perfect. <laughs> perfect, okay. Well, that was kind of stressful. Uh, okay. We've gotta go this way, is this that? Ooh. Oh. Oh, I remember, this is... Aha! Uh -huh. We were here before. This is where we went after boss time, but I couldn't talk to talk to anything because because combat, uh, co-op mode. Okay. Uh, is there anything else you'd like to ask? So this is like a library, more of an archive. Your description isn't off either. Ancient theatrical scripts, music scores, all the stories of things that have and have not happened. All of them were penned down and stored here. Someone once believed that if all of the possibilities in every story were exhausted, the secrets of fate would be unveiled. But the truth was not as complicated as he believed. Each person's fate is charted by their wishes, and the possibilities are not so great in number in the first place. Perhaps he too understood that in the end. Uh, I've still got a few more questions. Oh. Oh no, okay, not that. Uh, we, we pet the cat. Hello, hello. <laughs> oh, are we friends now? Are you gonna not attack me? I remember before it would always attack me if I was uncareful. <gasps> I think we're friends now. This is so good. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's see. What's this check? Ah, okay, we're missing a couple of chunks. Is that what Combine does? Ah, okay, yes, yeah, I think it does. But we don't have those chunks yet, so we're gonna have to find them somehow. Uh, okay, anything? Ooh, oh no, that's just the, the thing from down there triggering that. Can we, can we go in here? Oh, okay, now we just submit a book first. Hello. No. Ooh. That 
chest? Ooh, and a staircase. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is this is unideal. Oh no, there's three of them. Three of them. This is this is not good. This is this is bad. This, this is not great. These things are quite difficult. And there's the three of them. They're quite deadly. They're quite deadly. <laughs> okay. Is this gonna is this gonna work? Especially because they sort of come back to life if you're not careful. So I still need to defeat them one at a time. Which is, you know, unideal. It's much more efficient if you defeat them all, all together. But I can't do that because I attacked them at a different rate. And like the th I think the third one stopped fighting me. I got too far out of range. So that's, that's fun. Okay, well this one's down at least. But now I have to fight this middle one. Okay, the middle one's down. Okay, there's one left. There's one left. Oh! Okay, okay. Are you the only one left? Please be the only one left. Oh! Run, Klee! Run! Run! <laughs> Klee, you're not very good at running! <laughs> oh no. Oh no. It's fine. It's fine. We'll just, just keep jumping around. That will, that will solve the problem. Oh! Oh! This is fine! It's fine! Oh, it's down. Down. Perfect. Cleat. Cleat. Go, 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 Cleat. <laughs> and Hida. And everybody else. And everybody else. Specifically Cleat, though, because I think... Oh, no. Oh, no. It got back up. It got back up. Oh, no. This is this is not good. This is not good. This is unideal. Oh, Cleat. <laughs> okay. Well, we gotta... We gotta save Cleat. Oh, there we go. A oh, few. Oh. Well, that was stressful. <laughs> Oh, I do like this sort of funky statue thing, though. That's quite cool. Okay, so this is what we came in. There is a chest. Good. Oh, it's a good chest as well. Okay, that's that's nice. That's not disappointing. It would have been rather disappointing if it had been, you know, a regular chest. Because that was a very difficult fight. Oh. Can I pick up the sword? Let's read this notes first. Okay. Uh, that these, through these methods, the quality can be pierced, endowed with the form of its substance. So Mr. Remus is that ancient authority stripped away. Place within this way it is possible to recreate once more the perfect harmonious symphony that belonged only to humanity that played before their utter downfall. No more gods. Only man can rule over man. Substance and pr property are not important. Quality is what determines the essence of things. The object that plays the music, it could be the strings of a harp, a sword, or even... As long as it is an object bestowed with meaning anything. This sword forged from the bones of, to honour the memory of the noble Rogetia, had Phobos collapse, not cause her music to sing in the sea of pandemonium we could have together. For a moment of madness, he betrayed us all. The false god's will was like a weed floating upon the water, unable to rival that of humans. But that matters not now. In the end, humans alone should, shall we save, if only following lines have been brutally erased and cannot be read. Interesting. Interesting. I have a... Uh... Oh, it's just a belay. I really thought that was going to be like a quest item, but it's just, it's just a sword belay. That was a little disappointing. I really thought there was going to be more in here. I also hoped that, you know what would be in here? The, the missing thing that we need, the book scraps, but, but sadly not, sadly not. Okay, well. Well, I do remember that we were supposed to climb, so let's go up here and see if we can find anything else. Okay, what about in here? Can we... Can we go in here? Anything? Anything else? Ooh! I got a page! That's good. It has also occurred to me that uh, I was trying to figure out what was going on, and because I forgot, let me reread the instructions of how this is supposed to work. Let's. Oh no, maybe we should. No, it's one of the first things we did. Uh, this. Two types of sound waves. A poor sound wave and a play sound wave. And it has just occurred to me that this, like the the symbol, when you can see it, that is a um, that's a rest. <laughs> Which makes sense, and then this is just like notes, so you're <laughs> telling it to stop, like rest, 
and then you're telling it to go! Ah, <laughs> oh, okay, we definitely read the- oh. Last you found a note whether you're marrying treasure other than something. Nothing but a mora doesn't ancient bric-a-brac from storehouses. If what the golden hunter said was true, then the we initially sought has long since sunk to the bottom of the sea alongside Capitolium. Most of the relics here are from the golden troop, not. Regardless, we have not the time to retrieve the relics now. Our current priority is to seal this place. I have marked the location of the relics on the map, perhaps someday. Does that map match this map? Let's see. Let me zoom in. Funky bit. A little bit, let's see. I have no idea. If we explore everywhere, it won't matter because we will we will find it. Oh. But what is this thing? Can I hit it? Can I Ooh! Oh is that how we activated it last time? Oh, I think so. Well, that's exciting. That's exciting. I think that's the, the magical floaty staircase thing we were using last time to climb really high. Now, let's see. Is there anything else along here before we go up a level? Oh, that was a lizard. I didn't grab the lizard. Here you go, lizard. Thank you, lizard. I have grabbed the lizard. Uh, okay. Ooh, there's another... Another book thing. Aha! Aha! Ooh, this is really gonna give me the, the second part of the... Of the thing! We did it! Ooh. Did it not give me the second part of the book thing? Really? Let me check. Let me check. Did it did it give me That's not what I wanted. I wanted this. Oh, I only have one scrap. We need to find the other scrap still. Okay. Well. Seems like there's nothing over here. Oh, we gotta go, we gotta go back to the floating things. Uh, library ladder. Yes, a library ladder. They're so cool. <laughs> and the lizard. And the lizard. It's such a good lizard. Well, it's an average lizard, <laughs> but it's not a bad lizard. Okay. Now, I remember we did this last time. Am I gonna succeed, though? That is not a guarantee. Oh, oh, but there's a hidden book there. Where'd it go? I saw it! I saw it! Book! Book! Where are you? Well, that's... that's a bit rubbish. I... there was a book here. I swear, I saw a book! Where did it... where did it go? Well, there it is! What is it doing? Just hiding? Okay, well, we might have to come back for that book. They sort of assume there are only enough books to open all the doors, so if I miss a book, it's probably not going to be good. We're going to have to go back for that book, somehow. But, uh, I'm not sure how we're going to manage that. Okay. Ooh. 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 We need that book. <laughs> really? Okay. Let's find it. It was... It was over here, wasn't it? And it was just coming and going. Go on, book. I know you're here. I know you're here. But now I'm gonna have to go all the way back round. Ah, fine. <laughs> I knew I should have tried to get that book earlier. Okay, well we'll go, we'll go back this way and we'll get back on this thing and we'll all do it again. <sighs> oh, I fell. Okay, okay. Why are no more 
almost bought it. Oh! No, there it is. There it is. That was lucky, I almost fell, because I was gonna go over there and smack that thing again to see if it would trigger it. But luckily, I got caught by this thing, so I didn't have to. <laughs> okay, it feels like there's a big gap between them. Maybe it was the beginning of a cycle? Okay. Okay. Up we go. Up we go. And then we can put the mysterious book into the book place and see where it takes us. I am loving the fact that there are... These are magical bookshelves that open up to show you other places. And that... That is a very fun concept. I got an achievement for something as well. I wonder if it's an achievement for opening all of the books. Could be. <laughs> Could be. That oh it gave me the, the missing book. The missing the missing page scrap. Which is very nice. Okay, now now. Now we can go back down. All the way down. Whoop. Uh where is the cat? Cat? There you are. Hello. Now let's let's combine these. Ooh, guess the schools and peers together. Still can't something something. <laughs> okay, now what do we do with it? Anything else you'd like to ask? Uh, nope. What do we what do we do with that? What do we do with that? Once that school has been restored, someone learned in music we should be able to read the ancient melody contained within. Okay. Okay, well we went we've explored this section now. So so that that's good. Uh okay, let's Let's roll back out of here. Okay. Okay, so that's what was up there, and then Okay! Now, is there anything? In the water. Anything? Anything down here? Anything? Anything at all? We got it. We got to cover all of our bases because there are many places over here. Ooh, ooh! There is stuff down here. There's a lot of things down here, actually. Oh, good thing I, good thing I came down here. Okay. Well, let's get rid of some of these crabs. And there's another crab. Is that... Oh no, is the chest... A specific chest? Oh! Well, maybe I need to do... Ah! Okay, let's see. Let's do this. Oh, I missed it. Not like that. And then... This one. Where's the where's the music note? Hello? Hello? Where is it? How am I supposed to know what music note you want to be if it doesn't tell me? Okay, well this one wants to be Nope. That. And then what is what does this one want to be? Well, I mean, I could just try all three. <laughs> One of them's got to work. Uh, where could it? Where could it be? Okay, no, that didn't do it. Nope. Aha! <laughs> I don't think I did it the way I was supposed to do it, but it worked. It worked. Let me grab that. Uh, okay, and then what else is down here? There's some more stuff this way. Hmm. Oh. Can I go through this, this thing? No, that's a window. What about this one? That looks... No? Okay. 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 <laughs> let's let's get out of the water. 
Um, and I guess the only place left on this side is to go back to the middle. <laughs> nice catch at the bottom there. Which thing? Ah, yes. Jumping into the water was a good plan. <laughs> definitely, definitely a good idea. Um, okay, so now I'm here. Where does this go? Ah, nowhere. And I think that side also goes nowhere. But that's fine. And then this place is where we will be going later, because that's where the cat is. Which means we've got to go back over here. So we went left. Now we've got to try going middle. And then we've got to go right. And then... And then yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, what's, what's middle? Okay, we're middle. We're middle now. Ooh, some crystal flies. Aha! Very nice. Uh, okay. Middle. Down here. Okay. Oh, is this going to take me to the boss? Oh, I think so. I think this is the boss route. We already went to the boss. We don't really need to come here, but we'll, we'll check it out, just in case. Just in case. Ah, yes. This is the route to the boss. And there's a statue there. I'm gonna not fight him. I'm just gonna sail right over him. Uh, and then, yep, this, this looks like the boss. This is the boss. This is the boss. So we can go back. So we went the middle route. So we gotta go right now and see where that goes. Because I don't know. I don't know. And we need to know. And then we can go and into the secret hidden place and see where that goes. Is right even a route? This might not be a route. <laughs> this might just be a wall. Oh no, that took me... Oh, that, that was a fake wall. That was not a... That was not a wall. <laughs> There was not a route we were supposed to go down, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, okay. Wait, but I swear I went somewhere before that was like, somewhere different? So I definitely went somewhere that was before, I went into a different patch of water at some point. I remember doing that. Or did I? Did I imagine that? Anyway, I think we've now explored this entire area. So, so we can go um, talk to the cat and explore the actual place we were supposed to explore and uh, see what's over there. Cause I am intrigued. <laughs> okay, okay. Hello. Oh, do we, do we just go through? Ah, oh, okay. I've clicked the button. I've clicked it. I've clicked it. <laughs> Where are we gonna go? Uh, we now don't even a trace of civilization remains. Not the need to be wax subject then. Let's just get through this place. Oh, oh the cat. Hello. No, no, don't leave, cat. Don't leave. Oh, I want to talk to you. Hello. No. Okay. The cat clearly doesn't want to talk to me. Oh. By order of Dominus, both is exalted harmless and accordant with the most sacred, beneficent symphony of our great Sebastos. The initium Ioni are to be shot from today on. No one enters and no one leaves. The empire for a god king for human civilization. Okay. Go down, please. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Ooh, oh, the giant fish! Changing a fish, Paimon never thought we'd run into it here too. Does that mean we're supposed to follow the fish? I'm keeping an eye out to see if I'm missing anything, and I don't think I've missed anything. Like at all. Hmm. Just seem to be an Oculus somewhere here then. Oh, there it is. I see it. I see it. Let's grab that. Okay, well, the waypoint is unlocked now. 
Uh, where's this go? No, that's just where we were. Uh, okay, let's go down through this tunnel, I guess? Well, that looks like a tunnel. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I guess we're following the fish. Oh, and the cat's here! Oh, it's your Oz. <laughs> okay, ooh. <gasps> There's another fish. Wait, what? Is it chained up? Well, that can't be good. I'm guessing we're going right up to it to get to the waypoint. Ah, but it looks just like that glowing fish we saw before. There are still weird things tangled around the top nearby. What the heck is going on? I was getting more and more confused. I've heard this voice in a dream before. I can't remember his name anymore, though. Yes, you must have met him in the Sevastal's dream, did you not? Scylla, the a fell dragon who once served the Sevastals, he was subdued and sealed here by both us. Ah, was a super rude, subdued, and evil dragon. Paimon didn't think he could do something that amazing. Well, Fell Dragon was the name they gave, but it was no more than a fish app that was a teensy bit stronger than normal. After all, a new high dragon could be born as long as the mistress of many waters hibernated in the deep seas. I never thought the fish apps could get this large. After all, they are a little more than an uncultured barbarian. It would be unsurprising if they grew into something much stranger. In a case, the evil dragon Scylla was once the Sebastian's friend, but he revolted at a critical juncture in the shadows, showdown between us Rumerians and the Fontanians. At that time, Scylla led the brutal dragonborn to... Machismos, intent on breaking the, reaching the inner city Capitolium, where the Sebastos resided. Um, she knows I heard people talking about that in town. Yeah, the people in town were always talking about some Machismos and a bell tower or something. Correct, Machismos is the outer city of the capital, but should the fellow dragon wish to enter the inner city, he must pass through the inner Shimiani. That is the barrier separating the inner and outer parts of the capital, and the symphony weaved by the Sebastos and the musicians which covered all of Romeria pass through the inner Shimiani and its golden waterways. Othus and his leg legions used this fact to shut the Inishium Iani, thus finally seeing the evil dragon. Something's not right about that story. The dreamscape from before back then. Then I should have come and seen Remus before. Perhaps Scylla sought to go before the Sebastos was thrown, but such an opportunity is now forever lost. Afterward, the evil dragon sank alongside Romeria and the Sebastos too was lost, remaining so to the very day. Did you recall something, Keiko? It feels a bit muddled. That is true, I only heard tell of the events after it had all transpired myself, having not been in the capital when the disaster struck. Then, none knew just what had happened to the Sebastos. I feared that we can only learn more by proceeding further. The large living fish we saw in the castle must be thoughts that escaped from fishes in Scylla's stony cell. I fear he has already taken notice of our presence. Having been sealed here for so long, now that he's finally sent outsiders, he will naturally find a way to lure us in. But that's it. Hang on a minute, you said that the way to Domus Aurea is through those gates something, but hasn't both have shut them already? Does this mean there's no getting through? This will prove quite tricky, yes. Ah, there's got to be a limit to how rude you can be. What's this? I'll wait for you at Domus Aurea. Mwahaha, not when he won't even leave the door open, huh? You know, why don't we find some way to break the seal of the evil dragon and get the former foe he beat to break the door down for us? No, no, how can we do such a thing? I mean, after, this is one of... After, that is one of Rumeria's nemeses. But the enemy my enemy is my friend, no. Rumeria is long gone, no. The enemy my enemy is my friend. That's right, it's been so long, for all you know, he might have decided to turn over a new leaf and be a nice dragon. But he's still a dragon. Oh, come on, so what? Even if he is a dragon, he might be the reasonable kind we can talk with. We've got experience dealing with dragons, don't we, Keiko? Uh... <laughs> oh yeah, it's fallen, it's her apep. Look up, it's fallen. Ah, yep, that bit where he kicked up a storm in Mondstadt while on the infinite of the curse. We had a big fight because of it, too. Ah, uh, these examples weren't very convincing, were they? I'm taking that as a no. Ah, uh, come on, I'll say no matter how suspicious... No amount of suspicious looks is gonna suddenly give us better options. Uh, I know you're right, let's give it a try. The seals of Bind and Evil Dragon seem to be connected to three locations. Let's begin by removing the chains in those three places. Aha! Aha! Okay, this is this is what we want. Is that is that enough? Can we can we go explore now? Okay, I think we're not really supposed to explore. We're probably only supposed to explore with the quest. It looks a little bit like it's only gonna let me see things when we do the quest. Which case? Maybe we should uh leave this here. Because we didn't want to didn't want to do all of the quest. But you know what I will we'll run around a little bit. I won't try and do anything, but I just want look at this place. It's so pretty. So we'll just look at the waypoint. And then we'll like look for the other waypoints, but like look at this place. Look at it. 
It's so majestic. I mean, this side's a bit boring. It's just regular blue. But it is a very nice blue. But then, if you look the other way, look at that. It's all like pink and purple. How fun. And what's this thing? It looks a little bit like it's going to be attackable. No, I think it's just part of the furniture. That's okay. That's okay. But look at this place. And there's like a big, big whale. I'm a little bit scared of it, so I'm going to stay away. But there's a whole whale here. And there should also be a waypoint somewhere here. Oh, yeah, a waypoint. Let's grab that. I guess we can get all of these whale point waypoints. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> They're just bopping eels. I love that. It specifically told us. It specifically told us that these are bopping eels. Love it, love it. Uh, you're not the next half a year, or else you're just next over the quest. Hmm. That feels like too much quest. I mean, we, we have got quite far, but still. Oh! Fish! <laughs> but still, it feels like... like a lot. Like, that's not a good idea. So we'll get look at these waypoints. Maybe we can just run over there anyway. I mean, it won't light up, but maybe it will let us break through. We could try that. <laughs> I'm gonna try that, because... I think it's too... Ooh, what's this? Ooh. Ooh. I see. Interesting. Uh, but anyway, there's supposed to be another waypoint. Oh, there's the waypoint. Ooh. I don't like the look of that thing. That's a bit scary. What is this? It's an anglerfish. Ooh. Ah, I see. Okay, it looks like it's just a questy thing, which is fine. We can just ignore it then. We'll come back for that later. As long as it doesn't attack me, we'll be well. Oh, I was looking behind a door. Oh, is this the door we're going to break down? I see, I see. Well, we can go and look at the door. <laughs> but yeah, I think this is... Like, we already did a lot of quest, but it was mostly just exploring... But anymore, it will be actually the quest. <laughs> like, the other, the other half of the quest so far has mostly been, like, set up. But this, this is the quest quest. I'm not going to remember this the next time we come back if I try and do it now. So, we're going to just get the waypoint. And then we're also going to walk towards the door because I'm curious. Let's see if we can... Ooh. Ooh. So it's been tangled by some kind of strange plant. Seems complicated. In creatures within this region of water have been under the continual influence of the golden melodies. We can use the power of symphony to interact with them somehow. No, I just want to see what the door looks like. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ignore that. And let's see, let's see what's over here. Oh. Ah. Paimon, why? <laughs> Thanks for watching everyone, if you've enjoyed the video make sure to like and subscribe. If you'd like to see me play live then check out my Twitch channel. You can find me on Wednesdays and Sundays at 8pm GMT. Thanks again and have a great day!